In this lesson, you will see how to put in an arrival and an approach into the FMC. You will see the approach reference page. You will see how to put in a diversion airport and route. You will see how to put in a visual approach into the FMC and then link it to the diversion route. Flight 678 is ready to prepare for descent and arrival into Los Angeles. ATC provides your clearance. Use the arrivals page to put this into the FMC. First, show the departure arrival index page. Next, show the arrivals page for the destination airport. Stars are shown on the left. Approaches are shown on the right. If more than five stars or approaches exist, more pages are available. Show KLAX Arrivals page 2. Select the star. Only the selected star is shown. All other stars are removed. All transitions related to the selected star are now listed. These transitions are used to connect the route to the star. Select the transition. Select the approach on the next page. Like the selected star, only the selected approach is shown. The approach includes missed approach routing and holding if the missed approach procedure is part of the published approach. Approach transitions that apply to the selected approach are shown. These transitions include the IAF feeder fixes and fixes that provide routing to the IAF. Select the approach transition. The star and its transition, the approach and its transition have been entered. However, these entries often create route discontinuities. Show the legs page to check for route discontinuities. Legs page 1 is complete. Check the remaining pages. Connect the discontinuity. The discontinuity has been connected. The flight plan is continuous. Make the modifications active. Show the arrivals page to see the change. All stars and approaches for the destination airport are shown in their initial order. This lets you choose any star or approach if your clearance changes. Select the next page. The active star and approach are shown. The star and approach have been put in. Now you will see how to use the approach reference page. In flight, the approach reference page is shown when you push the initialization reference key. Show the approach reference page. 
The gross weight line shows the FMC computed gross weight or crew input weight. If you try to put in a gross weight that is not in the allowed range, Invalid entry is shown in the scratch pad. Each of the three VREF speeds are based on a landing flap setting and the gross weight. Entry of VREF and wind correction is discussed in another lesson. The go around N1 target thrust is shown. Information for the selected approach is shown. This information includes runway length, the frequency and identifier, and the front course of the selected approach. After the missed approach due to the earthquake at Los Angeles, all runways are closed. A diversion airport needs to be put into the FMC. Show the route page. Based on the data you have available, the best diversion airport is Fresno Air Terminal. Put in the diversion airport, Fresno, into the destination line. Enter the data as shown and select the correct key. Put in the expected routing after the missed approach holding. You can see the missed approach routing is still in the FMC. Show the legs page to see what remains of the missed approach procedure. Line 1 confirms the holding pattern will be active after you execute. Therefore, the airplane will not leave the holding pattern. This is good since you do not have clearance yet to leave holding. Make the modifications active. ATC needs to know what cruise altitude you want for diversion. Show the performance initialization page. The performance initialization page shows the optimum trip altitude. Based on your request, ATC has transmitted your expected clearance altitude. The clearance altitude may be put in on the performance initialization page, the climb page, or the cruise page. Put in the cruise altitude. Make the modification active. The weather is VMC at Fresno. Here is your approach clearance. Show the Fresno arrivals page. The visual approaches are shown after the header runways. Select the expected approach. An entry into the runway extension line creates a waypoint on final at a distance you specify. Put in the runway extension to create the waypoint on final.
Enter this data into the correct line. Check the legs page for discontinuities. A discontinuity exists between Avenal and the waypoint on final. Connect the first discontinuity. Another discontinuity exists between the waypoint on final and the runway. Connect the discontinuity. Make the modifications active. 